building time. Building time. Who will win and who will fall? Find, Find out, out when we burn the wall. It's building time. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Building Time. This is the show where me and Stabby Cat need to build in time on a Friday, which is today. On a Friday, which is Squid, on building. a Friday. Because it's Friday, and we need to build to do today. Ah, oh, a little there bit I've got a new theme, theme tune now. Forget that whole <laughs> building time. We're building on a Friday. Yes, we are. That's what we're doing. La, 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 la. <laughs> I'm just a musical talent. It's a musical gem I am. Uh, but yeah, it's a little bit of a weird one this week. So we're going to be doing this vote in reveal for the Halloween build, and then hopefully next week we'll do one for the Vox. So we're gonna we're gonna be like one step ahead now, which is a little bit weird, but it means that me and Stamps can carry on recording. So yeah, hope well, you don't we, mind. we won't be forever. Ba basically, I was I got a trip coming up. I thought it was gonna be I was gonna be away already, but then it got delayed. So we just need a video for when I'm away. So eventually things are going to be back to normal. But for now, we don't have the results for that week yet. But we have the results for this one. But things yeah. will be back to normal soon. We promise. <laughs> yeah. We promise. They will. They will. They will. They will. So yeah, let's reveal them. So this was mine. And this was Stamps. So mine got 38,000. And Stamps got 74,000. Whoa! <laughs> Not I even know. close, Squid. I don't Not understand. I really don't understand though, because I actually <laughs> thought that mine was going to be at least, you know, within the, you know, within the ballpark. But just, I, can't, I just don't, I just don't understand. I just don't understand. Yeah, like I don't like it's not. Bit of like a weird I, I one. think mine's, mine was more of an original idea. But like yours is big and like is is good. Like it looks good. Like your little man, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was decent. It's thrown me off this week. Well, yeah, so... Did you, like, upload your video late or something? Like, was... No, I did. I mean, my voting screen was a little bit weird because when I was recording the voting screen, I had, like, a house full of people. So it was literally just me making a lot of stupid noises. So that's probably why. Oh. Probably, probably the voting screen didn't <laughs> do, do think, it justice. Do you think that's the big thing? Like, yeah. Well, I guess at that point, they've already voted for you if they're going to hear that, I, I guess. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, a brand new week, a brand new build. And uh, I'm excited. It's going to be really good. So Stamps, do you want to do the honors, mate? Do you want to... Well, let me get let me get my swiftness potion. Is this is this the good one? I, I always got. I want to make sure I get the good one. Oh, uh, four minutes. Last That'll last do. week was the worst. I kept having like one minute potions, so I kept having to stop and slurp every minute. It was like Ugh, so annoying. It's difficult. It's, it's, it's an important part of building time. Anyway, yeah. So let's go. Let's find out what we are building. We ah. for the next fifteen minutes are going to be building a aquarium. 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 Uh, and that was suggested by <laughs> Ali uh, Brazilol. Brazilol. Bra Brazilol. How do you say it? Brazilol. 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 <laughs> Is that how you supposed to say it? Ali Brazilol. <laughs> Sorry if I offend anyone. Don't mean to. Um, <laughs> Sorry aquarium. if I offend Ali specifically. <laughs> right, an aquarium. Good suggestion, though, Ali. Good suggestion. So, um, mm. fish and the like inside of water. You it's know what fish. they are. <laughs> Great. Cool. So, oh, just, I'm just for our. <laughs> people listening that don't know what an aquarium fish and stuff <laughs> fish and stuff great fish great, great and example stuff. right should we do it let's do it yeah let's do it <laughs> on a friday <laughs> on a friday <laughs> <laughs> three two, two one, one and go, go. As always, the high quality professionalism from me and Squid before we start building. Right then, um, I'm going to build mine on a big table. I want to build mine on a big table, so I'm going to build it on a big table because that gives me time to think and it will make it look cool. So I could, so the, the kind of the, the two options is one to build like an aquarium where there's like a bunch of fish in it. You know, like, you know, like an aquarium you'd visit and you'd walk around and see kind of the different enclosures is that the right word when you're talking about fish probably not the, the right tanks the different t tanks of fish but i want to do just a giant aquarium like on a table that you would have in your house maybe and uh yeah just fill it full of, full of a bunch of animals so the kind of the tricky thing is is always how to to actually do the um the the actual water uh because if you actually do fill it full of water then that makes it very difficult to actually see what is inside of it so i don't know if i'm actually going to fill it full of water i could do um 
just build the entire thing out of ice and then maybe just fill the very top in with water just to kind of give the the effect as if it's filled in with water uh, but so you can still look inside and see everything that you want to see i think that's the way i'm going to do it rather than actually filling the entire thing full of water uh because you just can't see it you just can't actually tell what's going on so uh let's build let's build the big tank first out as i said out of ice i think is going to be the the best thing actually what what does this look what does ice through glass look like does that look any good can you even like see it or does it go like invisible ah that could actually be quite cool let's do glass then ice and then build everything on the inside so the glass looks like the outside of the actual tank and then the ice will look like the the water and then i'm gonna do like the um like fake coral and like gravel on the bottom of it and then i'm gonna do like a little you know the people always have like little features inside of their aquariums like little castles and, and things like that as well so i'm gonna do that stuff and then yeah then i can go and add some fish i've always been i've always been rubbish at building fish in minecraft it's something that i've actually tried to build on several occasions and i've always struggled with for some reason fish is not one of my specialities so maybe i could just maybe if i just build one big fish in the middle of the aquarium do you think that would look okay? Rather than going crazy. And maybe like some little sl uh, snails. You know, sometimes get people get like sea snails like on the, the side of the aquarium. <laughs> maybe I could have a, a few little ones of them as well. Maybe could be cool. Uh, but anyway, let's go. This is going to be the... um. The, the actual base of the, the aquarium here. It's going to be uh, slightly raised uh, off the, the ground like uh, like this. There's going to be basically one giant square aquarium uh, in the middle here. So I do wonder whether Squid's doing the same as me. I reckon he is. I reckon Squid is going to do a, a giant aquarium like I have uh, rather than... Um, uh, rather than kind of do, you know, the other idea where you could do it so you're walking through an aquarium and seeing a bunch of things. I don't know. If I if I know Squid, and I feel like I do, I reckon he's going to be doing something relatively uh, similar to, to what I was doing. But yeah, I think I've got my idea now. Like, I always just try and start building something big immediately, then it just gives me gives me a little bit of time to, to think while I was kind of just building this main thing here. So I put gravel in the floor, I build a little castle, uh, I do my sea slugs, and then I'm just going to go and try and build a giant fish. <laughs> somewhere in the aquarium and um i want it to be a cool how can i make it an amazing fish i could do like a rainbow fish maybe or hmm i'm not sure how to do the fish i could not have any fish in it i could just build an aquarium without any fish <laughs> I don't, like that just makes me laugh for some reason that the topics of the like an aquarium i could just build an aquarium without any fish the thing is though squid would think that i just ran out of time to do the fish but that wouldn't be the case and you see you know what if i if i do glass and then ice i'm really not gonna have very much room on the the inside does it look good Hmm, I think it does. I think I am going to do this because the thing is it is going to take a lot more time. So I basically need to build the entire thing twice. But I think it is a really cool effect. And I think it it does look better than actually putting real water in. So I think it's going to be worth the time to do this. And if I'm actually just going to not bother putting a fish in. Or I could do a giant aquarium and just have one little tiny fish in the bottom. I could do like a fish in an item frame or maybe literally just drop a fish, you know, like the item, just drop a fish in the middle <laughs> and just say, there we go. There is my fish inside of my aquarium. I think that that might be what I'll do. Who knows? I end up changing my mind a million times when I'm building these things. But anyway, I think, I think getting the table done quick, that was a good idea. And now I'm getting the actual aquarium part done pretty quick. So, you know, I'm not even a third of my time down yet. And I've almost already got the actual aquarium like tank part done you know i know i've got to do the the ice yet but i'm i'm on track i'm on track to to do well so this could end up being something pretty cool but i think for an aquarium you've got to if you just build a normal aquarium that's just going to be really boring you have to do something silly i think for the the aquarium so maybe it could just be a giant sea slug maybe that's what it is maybe there's no fish i know i keep changing my mind every five seconds here but maybe there's no fish but then just a giant sea slug in the the bottom of the, the aquarium <laughs> i like that idea i think that might that's my my new favorite idea so far that's probably going to change a million times before i actually start building anything but anyway i think i'm gonna stop doing the the glass now i don't know how high i actually um 
need to to go here um because i need to do the 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 ice as well but i don't want to i don't want to run out of time too much so let's go and uh let's go and do the gravel let's do a mixture of gravel and sand uh for the 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 bottom of this place here so let's kind of just uh alternate be between the two like this and kind of just go like that and kind of just fill the the entire area in kind of just uh, as randomly as we can i think that looks uh that looks pretty similar to, to what you kind of see in the the bottom of a, of a normal aquarium nope that <laughs> that is not what i meant to place there it's actually kind of quite quite tricky to to do this i'm kind of like pressing a lot of buttons at the the same time in order to keep switching so i need to hold down the left trigger and then keep switch oh no all right tell you what i'm gonna do was i'm just gonna only fill my inventory with gravel and sand and then that way i can't ever accidentally place the wrong blocks down that's a smart way to do this isn't it so let's go and get rid of uh, all of these and let's fill those gaps in with uh, with sand like that and then there we go the only things i have now is gravel and sand so i'm never gonna accidentally place the the wrong thing and there we go i'm getting it uh, all filled in pretty quickly um that was a load of sand there though i'll fill in all of the the, the gaps once i get round to it <laughs> i'm not building this very quickly am i i should just go and get this is what i should have done is just get um loads of sand and gravel and just fill up my whole inventory with it sorry i know i'm wasting time here i'm driving myself crazy as well but i've committed to it now and oh i see it's because i'm not like spreading them out i need to go like um like this kind of like that and then let's do the the same with gravel kind of like that there we go this is gonna be a little bit better so now i can just press like one button uh just to keep kind of switching between it like that and i can go and start filling in the the gaps like that i love the way i got like the outside of the aquarium and the table built so quickly and i've spent so long just filling in this ground this was a massive waste of time but luckily as i said i'm not going to be filling this thing full of loads of fish so it doesn't really matter too much because <laughs> it's not like i'm not gonna have time to build loads of things in it because if i am just gonna build one sea slug in the middle of this thing <laughs> it's not like i've wasted a crazy amount of time so let's just go and uh, fill in the, uh, the the rest of all of these gaps and uh, let's go and um before we do the, the ice and that, let's just go and build our slug then. Seeing as that is going to be the, uh, the the most important thing here, let's go and get our, our happy little slug done. Let me put the swiftness potion down. So uh, I think I'm going to do a, um, a green slug with like a brown shell, I think. So let's kind of go like this. This can be the the slug body and this is its kind of head coming up here like that and then we can have the the little like antenna bits kind of poking out it looks like a little buddy or something <laughs> poking up like like that and then we can uh because we're not going it's actually not actually going to be underwater i can add some eyes in like this then let's go and add the um uh let's add the the spirally kind of shell to this thing so what would be good do you think like clay what about like hardened what about these color clay what about like a mixture of these kind of spiraling out? Well, let's kind of just do like the shell shape and then let's see if we can go and add like a, a bit of a, a pattern to it, shall we? So let's go uh, to this side as well like that and then up like that. Then it can kind of go down to, to there and then have a, a little bit of that. Actually, let's do the bit of the tail kind of poking out there. That's like the the back end of the, the slug. Uh, like that. Does that look okay? There we go. That kind of looks a little bit like a, a slug, doesn't it? What about if I kind of change that like uh, like that? I think I need to change this bottom bit to, to be green as well. That might uh, make it look a bit, a bit more like a slug. And let's make this uh, the shell. Uh, slightly bigger as well I think would be good and I think I need to make the entire tank bigger as well now <laughs> and then maybe fill these bits back in there like that no it doesn't look shell shaped anymore I think I need to to, to leave it like that there we go here is our snail then let's see if we can kind of do a um a bit of a of a pattern kind of like spiraling out maybe that look okay i think that looks okay let's kind of just do the 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 same on this side here how was it It was went down and then kind of just like a, a right angle like that so there we go here is our snail inside of the aquarium <laughs> i have to get a move on now because there's a lot more that i want to do and i am now really starting to, to run out of time so all right i got my ice uh, so let's go and um let's go and just do the the ice here because at the moment it just looks like there's no water in the tank which isn't the effect i want i want it even though i'm not actually adding real water i want it to to look like there is water in it so that's kind of where the the ice comes in so 
Let's fill this, and then it'd be good to, to, to make the, the tank a little bit taller. I know I wanted to add a castle and kind of other decorations inside of the tank, but I just might not have time. It'd be good to add at least a little bit of greenery, you know, just like some some plant life inside of the, the, the aquarium. That would look good. But then again, it is still... Let's leave it as it is for now, because it is still pretty funny just having this huge tank and then just just a giant snail just sitting in the middle. I don't... Am I the only one finding this funny? Like, I hope you're not sitting there going, Stampy, this is rubbish. When I'm here finding it absolutely hilarious to have this big aquarium with just a big <laughs> slug in the middle of it, a big sea slug. It just makes me laugh for some reason. So hopefully you are enjoying this as well because it's certainly I'm certainly keeping myself entertained at the end of the day and I guess that that's what's kind of important when you're you're building these ridiculous things. So uh, right, let's go and um, let's build this up probably like two blocks higher, uh, the actual um, uh, rest of the the uh, the aquarium section and it would be good to add water along the, the top. I just, I just don't know if I'm going to have time to do that to be honest. I'm really... Uh, starting to, to run out now. So let's just um, uh, build this up a little bit higher. I'm sure if it comes down to it, like really last minute, I can kind of run down there and just start putting any old plants in. Like some sugar cane or something would look good, but I can't really place I can't really place water inside of it because that would kind of ruin the, the effect a little bit. So uh, let's just build uh, this up, as I said, too higher and go and fill in the, the ice in. And then it's just going to be final details. And I think I will have time. I think once I fill this in, I will have uh, probably about a minute and a half for all of my final details. It always ends up being that. It always ends up me talking about all of these things I'm going to do and then I end up with no time at all just to rush everything at the, the very end. <laughs> I am getting better. If you look back though, if you go on a history trip and go back to like the first building time episodes, we did much more often run out of time and not finish what we're doing. I think I've, I've learned much better now what I can realistically build, you know, within 15 minutes, you know, like I think I just understand my limitations a bit better. So I'm, I'm always more, I always have like a safety point where I'm like, you know what, even if time ran out now and I couldn't do anything else, that is okay. All right then, I think, I think I might be able to add some water and I'd need to go higher though to add water in. So what I'm what, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to do like a floor of um of ice. So uh, uh, this layer here I'm going to fill the entire thing in with uh, with ice and then I can place water on the top of that and fill the entire thing in. But before I do that, I need to to do any last minute additions inside of the tank. So let's go and uh, add a little bit of seaweed. We can kind of do this kind of all going up here like this, just, you know, just a, a bit of plant life kind of just uh, around the place, just uh, as randomly as we can, uh, just to, to make this look good. We can do some dark green ones here as well, uh, like that. Can I place down like any like grass and stuff on, on any of these? No, I need to put some dirt down. So let's go and put some uh, some dirt down around the place. And uh, put some of uh, of these down around here just to add a little bit more detail. I am really, really running out of time. You know what? I don't think I'm gonna have time to put water along the top. So I need to put I need to put all of the the ice on and then the water on top. And I'm rapidly running out of time. Actually, no, I think I can do it. I think I can do it. If I'm really fast now, I think I might be able to do it. Right, let's go, 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 go. I need to commit. I need to commit to this. All right, this layer is gonna be filled in with ice. And then I gotta put water down on the top. I have about a minute and a half left to do it. I don't like the um. I don't like these. I don't like. I don't like the look of these. Let's break these down. Down a little bit. I think I made them too big. So let's go and break all of that down. There we go. It's just like a little bush. <laughs> right then, I got about uh, yeah, just under a minute and a half to get all of the the rest of this done. I think I think this is doable. So uh, this just means that if you look at the um the aquarium from the the top, it is gonna still keep the the effect of it entirely being filled up with uh, with uh, with water. Uh, hopefully this looks good. Hopefully this does actually end up <laughs> looking in any way decent. Uh, fingers crossed. I like my slug. I need a name. I need a name. I'm gonna call my slug Sally. It's Sally the slug, and she lives inside of her aquarium, and she's very very happy there. And hopefully she's gonna have water above her head. Otherwise this entire thing's gonna look silly. But I now have less than a minute, and I'm starting to get a little bit panicky. It looks like squid hasn't built anywhere near as high as me but i guess he probably wouldn't have um put his aquarium on a table that was a bit of a, a weird addition for me to do at the, the very beginning to, to put the uh, the aquarium on a table so i reckon his is probably just uh, much lower down but, but because of that so all right then let's just go and try and fill in all of this water we want it like completely uh, flat with no waves like that and what i can actually do is uh, break a little hole down here and i can go and start adding a, a few more of these um uh, of this grass uh, just because I have a little bit of spare time at the the end uh, just to add a few more of these around the place then I just need to, to fill up the the gap I broke and then that's going to be me pretty much done ice in place glass in place there we go there is Sally the slug living inside of the the aquarium 
<laughs> I like it. I'm happy with it. That's time up though. So let's go and speak to, to Squid and uh, see how well his is doing. Oh no, I've got to play some um, got to play some water along here as well. Bop, 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 bop. There we go. <laughs> right, let's speak to Squid. <laughs> ah, hello, hello, Squid Nugget. Squid Nugget, hello. I can see him, but he's not moving. Squid Nugget, hello. Hello. I had some problems turning my timer off. <laughs> they were just going okay. a bit mental. <laughs> I just saw you just standing there. I was like, I can see him, but he's not doing yeah, anything. I'm not, I wasn't What's doing anything. I was, I was trying to control my timer. <laughs> oh, man. I enjoyed right. that. That was a fun one. Did you like no, that? that was stressful. That was so stressful. Oh, it's <laughs> jolly. I was happy. I was having fun the whole time. <laughs> right. Let's see yours then. Okay. Let's go and burn the wall. Burn. I, I, I was messing around with my webcam last night and... Um, I had it in 4K, and then my camera went off halfway through the video, and I was like, why? And I was like, oh, I didn't ch switch it back to, um, four, um, yeah, the 780, whatever it is. You know, like the normal quality. So, like, my camera's been recording, like, 4K, so my face is going to look very beautiful at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to see every pore, every, every imperfection, <laughs> the sweat on your brow as you're panicking. Yeah, <laughs> everything. <laughs> right. Oh, dear. Oh, this looks cool. So it's this like, is oh, like this giant aquarium. This is Sally the sea slug. <laughs> Where's Sally? Oh, hello, Sally. You see her? You see you? If you come here, you can kind of see her from the front. But yeah, this oh. is this is Sally, Sally the sea slug, and hello, she lives Sally. alone in this giant aquarium. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cool. The big aquarium. She's massive. <laughs> yeah, well, she's she's a big sea slug. Like I kept changing the idea. Like at first I had the idea of it just being like a huge aquarium with one tiny fish, and then I was like, what if it's just a massive aquarium with just a big sea slug in the middle of it? That just really <laughs> made me laugh. So, but there there came Sally. <laughs> cool, I like it. It's really good. Um, yeah. So mine, I I put the fish in at the last minute, so hopefully they're still there. Go in. Ah, uh, you did like a walk in a quest. I actually guessed that you would have done the, something the same as me, but you've done like a, an actual walk around aquarium. <laughs> so there's some fish to your left, some different Lots fish to your right. Clam fish, some salmon over there. There's some more here. Puffer fish. Little, pu little puffer fish. Puffer fish. <laughs> and then and here's then the penguin area. Fish. You can come up here and there's some the penguins. There's the penguin, the penguin fish. Like lots of eyes. They got loads of eyes. <laughs> <laughs> like alien penguins. <laughs> oh dear. Who's the penguins? Oh, ah, a very penguin. open enclosure as well. They're free to wander off. They're, exactly. they're not even trapped. They just like it here. <laughs> I didn't like the idea of animals being cooped up. So it's they, they can come as they please. They can wander off if they want. So it's fine. Yeah. And that's why you didn't put any walls in. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> 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 oh, I, no, I love this because we once again we've done very very different things, which is always always you know like look look at them side by side. They're they're pretty uncomparable. You know they're just different, yeah, they're very completely different. different style of things. You know one's a big sea slug and one's a whole aquarium. But <laughs> right then, so that's it in terms of the building for this week. Yeah, it's been good. So make sure you vote, guys. You can do it in the same way as always. Click in the top right corner. There's a vote squid vote stamps. And click in the description. There's also a vote squid vote stamps link. You can click on that. And that's a vote. And also make sure to leave some suggestions for next week's building time where we're going to be building something completely different. So, and you can okay. still, if you want, uh, vote for the um, the, the volcanoes. Uh, if you didn't see uh, last week's, uh, that's my volcano on the left, squids on the right. If you want to vote for them, uh, you still can. The votes still will uh, count. They're basically, the votes will count until you see a video saying that they don't count anymore, essentially. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's it for this week, guys. Hopefully you have enjoyed, and we'll see you next Friday for a new building time. Bye! Bye!